What are nine things you can do to reduce or prevent cancer? Let me tell you some tips, and it's coming from a two-time cancer survivor. When I was in medical school, I had a cancer, got radiation therapy. 17 years later, I was on staff at Mayo Clinic, got lung metastases. This time, I was married with three kids, the smallest two years old. So I decided then and there, I didn't want to ever have cancer again, and what could I do to prevent it? Let me tell you what will work. None of us want to have cancer, and we all want to do all we can to avoid it. So what things can you do? Well, nutrition is very important. Eating more fruits, vegetables, legumes, very helpful. Organic may actually be better to reduce cancers because you avoid the chemicals. Certain fruits like peaches, strawberries, grapes, try to get those organic because the, whatever the pesticides would be on the outside. Other thing, certain diets will increase cancer. Keto has been shown to increase cancer because it's more meats and processed meats can certainly increase cancer. Exercise is important. Physical activity reduces almost all cancers, except one. What's the one cancer physical activity actually increases? It's the cancer you get from exercising outside, obviously skin cancer. So when you're exercising outside, wear sunblock or something to prevent that from occurring. What else can you do? Well, obviously smoking increases cancer. Alcohol, more than maybe a drink a day, will increase risk of GI cancer, mouth, all the way down to your uh, bladder will increase that cancer. So take it easy on that. There's no evidence that sleep uh, will affect cancer or stress necessarily. Uh, weight does increase cancer. Obesity, people have more gut cancer, more breast cancer in women. What other things can you do? Well, certainly uh, have a healthy lifestyle in terms of avoiding risky behavior. You know, um, safe sex, don't share needles, things like that. Uh, also, vaccinations are helpful. There are certain viruses we get, uh, Epstein-Barr virus, other viruses that the standard in, uh, immunizations we get reduces the chance of getting that infection from the virus and the cancer that occurs with it, like some of the cancers in uh, hepatitis in the liver. And then finally, regular checkups help. You know, have someone go over your skin, make sure there's not a skin cancer that's uh, coming along. Make sure they uh, check your prostate, a man, breast in a woman. Uh, the one thing for the youth, meaning men 20 in their 30s, the number one cause of cancer death is testicular cancer. So make sure you uh, do self-exams uh, on your testicles in the shower. Uh, make sure you don't have any lumps or bumps. If you do, report it. Have somebody check it out. So those are nine things you can do at least to reduce or prevent cancer. Very important, a little bit of prevention goes a long way in this regard. So I'm Dr. Steve Kopetsky, a preventive cardiologist at Mayo Clinic. And after surviving two bouts of cancer, I tried to find out what types of behaviors people could adopt to avoid disease, avoid illness, and live a long life. To learn more about this topic and so much more, check out my book, Live Younger Longer, written by me, Dr. Stephen Kopetsky. You can find the book at mcpress.mayoclinic.org or wherever you buy books. Thanks for listening. See you next time.